this project started a couple of months ago when myself and Mick here got talking about uh, the Year of Light. So I got in touch with uh, the guys of Year Light Ireland in NUIG. We, we travelled down to Galway and we uh, brought this. One second, I will show you. We, uh, we have a prop. A really efficient, brand new light. And if you even look at the lens there, it's really clear. We brought that for them to see what, where our technology is at. Make there's clouds, Steve. Go, go right. Go right. Yeah. Now we're in clouds. That's the deepest colour we put for one minute in the So that's, that's full, the absolute bottom. Yeah. That's yeah. full cyan and full magenta. There's no lab out there that can do it. The way we think about light and the way other people think about light and then I guess the way the, the general public think about light are completely different ways. And I suppose with this project, if somebody comes and looks at the spire, if we can even make them think for 10 seconds, well, what is light or how does it affect me on a daily basis, then let's bring in the air of light to everybody in the country. We are lighting up the spire because it's going to be visible all over the city. It's also called the Monument of Light. It's one of the largest monuments in this part of the world. This is to indicate that we are beginning uh, an International Year of Light, which is going to help us to get the message out that uh, photonics is very important in our lives. It drives the internet, it drives medicine, it drives discovery, it drives media, the arts, cinema. Dublin city centre has been illuminated for the first time. The project is in collaboration with the UNESCO International Year of Light. Oh, my, I had a lot to live, but my mind was slow. 